Behind the scenes, behind the lines, inside the stories others won't tell. The Morning Insiders. The Morning Insiders want to give a taste of summer during the dead of winter. Check out this lovely sanctuary. Residents trying to bring a little joy to their public housing home backyard. But management didn't see it that way. CBS 2's Lauren Victory on the plant police taking all this greenery away and more. Give me a reason. You're watching a heated argument that make sense to you. between tenant and landlord. Smack in the middle is Maria Sopena guarding her cabinet. I had a lot of gardening things in there, expensive things. The cabinet was right here. Management hauled it away. My table was right here. Along with other property on the porch. The Chicago Housing Authority tells us these things were a fire hazard. They took the hose. They took the hose. Hmm. Oh, they plant too? Yep, her plants too. I had organic tomatoes and peppers. CHA didn't answer our question about what hazards the plants posed, but did say these items violated public space and courtyard storage policies. Somehow that prohibits this kid's picnic table. No. Also taken. I feel like they stole my things. You know, when I come home from work, I'm, I'm, I'm exhausted mentally and I like to garden. I like to go outside and sit outside and, and have my plants around me, the beauty. I relax. CHA points to these notices, hand delivered to residents twice, followed by a phone call. But the written warnings only mention back porch, not this bag of soil. So Pena admits she lost her cool a few weeks later, slapping a worker who came back to take away more. A huge uh, planter that was ceramic, that wasn't cheap. I spent my hard earned money on these things. The gardener estimates more than $1,500 lost in a claim she submitted to CHA. I love to garden. It's, it's my therapy. Why? Because I live on CHA property. I can't enjoy the outdoors. I can't have flowers. Interestingly, we found the agency applauded resident gardening on its YouTube channel less than four years ago. Lauren Victory, CBS 2 News. Sapina is fighting the charges against her. CHA says it is reviewing claims made by tenants about their belongings.